going back to my roots. Blame it all on my roots. I know you know it. I showed up in boots. I'll stop but you know I want to continue. Anyway, I'm at Costco today. I'm gonna hop inside and do a shop with me, explore all the new things. I am at my local Costco. I need to order contacts. I needed to like three weeks ago, but every time I cut, it's a whole thing. Okay, and then also can we talk for just five seconds about Costco parking lot and how it drives me actually insane. I think I'm okay now that I found a parking lot, but oh, did I say a few choice words trying to find one and then being cut off and like, excuse me, ma'am, I've been waiting for this one. Funny enough, I ended up parking right next to her, so I might leave a fun little note on her window. I definitely won't. I'm too much of a pupil pleaser for that, so I'm gonna hop inside. Maybe I'll run into her with my cart. All right, let's go inside and see what Costco has for us to enjoy probably a lot of full stuff. Well, I could cry. I forgot my vacuum to return because it's less than a year old and I wanted to uh, bring it back because it's already broken. I don't know what's happening. This is a four piece cotton handset. Ooh, hand towels, $8, normally 11. I'm actually in need of some more and $8 is a screaming deal for four. They also have large towels. Holy fajoli, $5. For these plush 30 by 58 inch bath towels so they have a few different colors gray green a deep blue and white and then the summer stuff is not on sale but it's out here they're trying to get rid of it didn't we see this last week and it was like five bucks it's normally 20 it's 14 for you today i think it maybe it was a princess set and maybe they were going out on clearance so three pack is $13.39 of Dove body wash. It's normally $16.89. And then they have a two pack of Aveeno moisturizer. Whoa, this is a screaming deal because one of these at a normal store is like $12.89. And hey, that's what it is on sale today. Normally $17.89. They have the Roche vitamin C. Does this break you out? 100% brighter, tighter, wait, brighter, tighter skin? Interesting. Revive and Glow, 35 bucks, normally 50. A lot of skincare products. And honestly, I mean, they're marketing to the right audience right now. Okay, $30, normally 48 for these Crow Feet Firmness and Puffiness Serum. Tighten and Lift, oh yes. Normally $70, it's on sale for 45. Like, do we believe any of these claims? Has it worked for you? I need before and after photos immediately. And then the Hydro Boost. Hey, they came back with this. It's on sale for $20.99, normally 30. I feel like the containers are maybe smaller. This is 1.7 ounces each, and it, it is the Hydro Boost Hyaluronic Acid Gel Cream for extra dry. It's fragrance-free. I used that for a while, and it's fantastic. Not sure it did anything, but it felt good. <laughs> they Oh, they have the telescopic, a lot of beauty products up here. So they have the telescopic, two mascaras and an eyeliner. And this is $18.99, normally $23. Wait, is this the one that had a lot of controversy around it? If so, it is as fantastic as everyone says. 60% longer lashes, extreme length and ultimate definition. You better believe it. I mean, look at those. They could be fake though, who knows? They have some oral hygiene on sale. N wait, $9 for three of them? Jeez, is it mostly water? I don't even know. I don't use Swish. Alex does. I don't know, I have a thing about it. Just tastes real nasty. I think elementary school ruined it for me. They have a tube of Crest White Strips. This is a five pack, holy fajoli. $12, normally 16, and then they have Sensodyne, not on sale. It's a four pack for $26 though, so I feel like that's a screaming deal. Also Pro Namel, $25 for a four pack. Ooh, yes, finally, another sale. On Liquid IV, if you missed the last sale, here's another chance to pick it up. You get 30 sticks in here for $22.99. It's normally $29, and even that's a good deal for 30 of them. I love this stuff more than I could ever explain. Strawberry is my favorite flavor. They decided to combine the strawberry with golden cherry. So you get 15 of each. They have other flavors too, but that just happens to be my favorite. Oh, and then the first time I've seen this, this is the liquid IV, the sugar-free one, hydration multiplier. This is so good when, I mean, especially for Florida summers, but when you're feeling particularly dehydrated, like if you're gonna be outside all day, at least that's what I do if we're going to a theme park or in my pregnancy, I drank this a lot. I mean, they didn't have the sugar-free one back then, but now they offer it. And this is flavor is lemon lime. 
So that's great. And that's on sale and you get 24 on the go packets for $22.99. And then they have this one that's the hydration plus immune support and you get 24 packets in here for $23 as well. So this is just a great electrolyte and I love it. My OB suggested that I use that during pregnancy and I just never stopped because it just helped me so much. They have the collagen peptides and probiotics, 23 bucks for that, normally 32. The plant protein drinks, they have this. And then they also offer some that are like kid version that kind of tastes like cereal. I can't remember it. I did take a taste test when they had a tester out and I was like, Ugh, so it was horrible, but I don't like flavors in my drink. So it goes to say a lot of the liquid IV of how good it is. But anyway, this is $21, more only 28. So if you like it, there it is. And then the Premier Protein, they have, ooh, some sports bras right up front. A Lady Brawlette two pack for 15 bucks, screaming them. Ooh, a charcut board. Ooh, Damperid, actually, that's the first time I've seen this at Costco. This is a Damperid Max. You get a four pack in here for $13 and you just hang that in closets or whatever. Probably great for Floridians because we, the humidity is so wild and crazy. <gasps> a grazing board. Look how long this thing is. Am I gonna come home with a grazing board? Oh, this is 31 and a half inches with handles and it's $20. Oh my gosh, someone tear me away. I might throw that in my cart otherwise. And then they have the back to school leftover bottles couple different colors on here. $13 for two, screen men deal. I love the ones with the straws and that's what that is. <gasps> Another first time item here. We've got the Dyson. Oh, Costco knows what we want. This Dyson supersonic hair dryer and a stand. What kind of stand does it come with? It is on sale right now, actually. It's normally $430, which is outrageous. It's still outrageous at the low, low cost of $340. But Costco, you have outdone yourself with this one, offering this gem to us. Hey, if you have been in the market for wanting one of these hair dryers, you guys, you can spend $340 on this, or I got a little hack for you. It's free. You let the air do it, the outside air. You just let it dry, okay? That's what I do. Maybe that's why my hair always looks so bad. Okay, we've got some uh, bread right up front. Carbs are life. I showed this to you last time. They have a bunch of fall stuff up here, so I'm gonna show you some fall items, but they have this Disney Halloween set ensemble. It comes with 12 pieces with like uh, Pluto. Actually, Alex tried to show the kids the Goofy movie the other night. Wait, did I just say Pluto? Wait, that's Pluto, right? No, that's Pluto. Oh, I need to brush up on my Disney trivia. That's Mickey? <laughs> anyway, he tried to show the kids the Goofy movie and they were not having it. I was like, these kids are so dang spoiled. But this is the whole setup. Loving the tree. If you do a spooky a setup like that, what is that called? Like a spooky village where people do Christmas villages or whatever. Ooh, this is a nice size hand hooked accent rug. Hand hooked. Couple different prints on this and they're each $20. And the size is a little oblong, which I think is nice. A few pillows here, accent pillows. Ooh, my goodness gracious, they feel fantastic. I know you've had your accent pillows for over a week, so it's time to switch it up. Okay, $10 each pillow. And um, I was being sarcastic. The fan is right above me, so I apologize if that's all you can hear. Unlock a healthier you. Have you heard of this? A Galaxy Watch 6. Oh, it's on its sixth string. Where have I been? Clearly I am unhealthy but I like the smiley face it offers. This is $290. Oh, someone wants a concert at Costco. Over here, you guys know I have a soft spot in my heart for some Costco PJ sets. Unfortunately, these are all pants, so it's a no for me. I might change my mind later. I'm loving this print, it's giving Pioneer Woman, right? Oh my gosh, $12? Okay, well that might change my dang mind. Loving this two-piece pajama set and they have it in a few different color variations. So they have plaque and then floral. Wait, is it inside out? I don't know what's happening. They've got pink floral. They've got whatever kind of leopard print this is, but it's $12. And then they have some joggers over here. These are $15 if you're looking for some Fila joggers. They come in black, gray, violet. They know exactly what us Floridians need. These ladies' vests, they are on sale $11, normally $14, which I still feel like is a screaming deal. And these are like lightweight enough where you can, could wear them just as a fashion piece, 
I'm sure it traps in the heat, which is not something I'm interested in, but if you are, here they are, all the colors, black, green. This is much more green. That's an accurate representation of it. Up here, it looks kind of gray. Uh, nice blush and then uh, a beige. <laughs> okay, and then we have some more pants. What are these, just leggings? All kinds of colors. As long as they have pockets, I would say worth it, and they do. Oh, they're the relaxed fit, so they're not like the skin tight ones, which I feel like is a trend that I'm not on board with. <laughs> my kids are, but I don't know, I'm stuck in my ways. Okay, these are tapered. I can dig it. They still have this couch here for $1,400. I think this is actually one of the pullout couches we looked at before we bought our sectional pullout couch, which we absolutely adore. This is $1,000. Yeah, it is, okay, it does pull out. Do you need me to show you? It's actually really easy. Should I show you? I don't think it's necessary. All right, well, maybe. Let's see, hopefully the pillow. See, it's so simple, I can do it with one hand. And then it just like flops up. You get it, okay? It ends up looking like this for a thousand bucks. I don't know if that's worth it, but <laughs> here it is. I highlighted a lot of the furniture items last time I came. This 30 inch vanity is $380 and it looks really nice. If you're looking for a little vanity like this and it comes with like the countertop and sink, it's a screaming deal. And then they also have this one for $80. This is a 60 inch. Guys, I feel like at our last house, we were looking for a vanity and they are so pricey. I don't know why I'm pulling those drawers. Oh my gosh. And it comes with like built in organizers. Amazing. If those other fall pillows weren't your vibe, they have a few of these like faux leather decorative pillows. These are $12, normally 15. So this could be pretty cool. They always have some like outside vendors coming in and right now they have the infinity. Bring the spa home to you. How much is this piece of crap? Please remove shoes. Oh, wow, do you wanna know how much it is? <laughs> Try it, you'll like it. Heck yeah, I'll probably like it, but can I afford it? What does it do, charge my phone and stuff? What's happening? All right, so this is $9,000. It's got a triple foot roller, kneading calf massage. It's got a back massage, zero wall fit, true fit body scanning. I literally barely have 30 seconds to go to the bathroom. Like, who do I think I am that this will actually be something I'll be able to fit into my lifestyle? <laughs> Are these new carpet designs? I can't remember. So different colors, different designs. This one seems to be on sale normally 150, which is still a screaming deal for almost seven by 10 foot, uh, $120, which is amazing. So I'll show you some of the different prints, pretty abstract, which is nice. And then this one is $180 same size. This is also the same size and $219. Seems to be a little thicker. Also non-shedding, also different prints. But if you're in the market for a little accent rug over here, oh, it's machine washable. I like that. I can dig it. These are $13. Oh my gosh, these are back. Yes. Actually, how much are these? I love these everyday floor runners. I'm looking for where it has like the different prints. Oh, maybe this one doesn't have it. Okay, so let's just scan like the, like that's a nice one. I do need some more for outside. We've had ours for probably four years, if not more, and they are showing signs of wear, mostly because we put them outside. Okay, so three different prints right here, which are extremely light and uh, not for me. These look a little darker, but I still can't find the different prints. I really like this one, even though it has a little bit of white in it. Oh, I kind of like this one. I don't know, I guess this is what it looks like. These are $13 and I will likely regret not getting them. Actually, the Britain ones, the lighter ones, these are 20, those are 13. I'll regret either choice that I don't make, but I'm too fickle to make a decision right now. This one is a Fiesta area rug and this is 45 bucks. It's a five by seven, essentially. And then they have these outdoor rugs, indoor outdoor rugs, 100, and then whatever that is for 130, and then more area rugs for 90. Hello, darkness, my old friend. I am back at the vacuum section. I don't wanna be here. This is literally the last place I wanna be. Should I buy a new one? Like I need a vac, I literally need a vacuum. I forgot to bring mine with me. I could cry. This one looks impressive. Oh my heck, $300. I'm sorry, that's gonna be a no for me. I think this is similar to the one that I have, but also nearly $300. Okay, this is the one I have for a whopping 190. I did get it on sale, I wanna say, but I forgot mine to like bring it back. Oh, I have to make another trip up here. I can't just buy an iRobot. I'm actually, 
even unsure if they're going to exchange it, I'm just gonna do my best and ask. <laughs> like, I don't know, it's been under a year. It's unacceptable in my book. Anyway, the iRobot, this is on sale and I've actually been on the hunt for one of these. Ours has been out of service for probably a year, at least because when the baby was born, it wasn't working. So, oh my heck, you guys, can I tell you a story about a robot vacuum where there's a company that has reached out several times to me and it's like, hey, do you wanna do a sponsorship? And they're offering so much. And I'm like, no, I can't. The vacuum is like a thousand bucks. I'm like, I can't tell you guys, I would never buy that on my own. I'm not, I can't be like, this is amazing. You guys should buy it. Like, I'm sure it is amazing for a thousand dollars. It better be amazing. It also better watch my kids and pay for a night out on the town for my husband and myself 10 times over. <laughs> but this is on sale. So, um, this is the iRobot Roomba. Normally it's $660. It's on sale for 530. So that's a pretty significant discount. I think uh, it, I, it hurts my heart to do this, but I think I might buy this one today. We had our old one for a very long time. We had it in the previous house, but our house, there's just furniture everywhere. So we ended up putting it up, but in our newer house, we like it because there's a bunch of space and it actually helps out and actually does its job and doesn't get stuck on everything. I don't know. I might hold on. Oh, wait, it holds 60 days worth of dust. Yeah, right. Okay. That's like two days worth of dust in my house. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to think on this, but I know I'm going to think on it way too long and then the sale is going to pass and then I'm going to be kicking myself and then I'm going to go another year without a robot vacuum. And just that is my life. Little green machine, a hundred bucks. I feel like I got mine. It, it looks a little different than this but I got mine off of Amazon when they had an Amazon deal, like literally two years ago for 50 bucks, but this is a hundred here. So maybe the price went up just like everything else in America. Uh, they've got a car seat. Okay, some travel luggage. All I can think about is that vacuum right now. Uh, tell me, am I making a bad choice by not getting it? They have this safe again. Hey, for 500, what are we putting in our saves? Oh, guns, no big deal, okay. I just looked up the vacuum on Amazon. Uh, uh, you guys, uh, the internal battle. Okay, the laundry company, this thing's going out. It's got the asterisks, but it's $50. I still struggle with that word, asterisk, asterisk. So it looks like they have these candles. These are going out for $20 and something smells. They smell very light and nice and airy. I really enjoy them. Very mild scents. They also have these for $20. I think these are new. Oh yeah, these are like the fall holiday scents. So we've got toasted vanilla, balsam cardamom, berry clementine, and birchwood. Oh my gosh, they smell good. These are probably the best smelling candles I've ever smelled at Costco. Like I can actually smell them, incredible. And they are luxury. Ooh, over here, bamboo food organizer. This is $18, comes in a pack like this. Hey, jumping on that bandwagon. Oh, the thing about these is you can separate them so you can configure them however you want. So that's a bonus. These ramekins are a great deal too. You get two, four, six, eight. Ooh, an eight piece for $10. That's a screaming deal. So they come in and you can either get all white or they have the colored variety. You can cook and serve which is the great thing about ramekins, or you can just shove stuff in them for like a charcuterie board, breakfast board, dessert board, whatever you want. So I always like to have some ramekins on hand for that. I got a pack of four from like Home Goods a while ago, and that seems to fit the bill. They have these ceramic bowl sets still for $13, normally 20. Ooh, this is new. Okay, these sides, serving bowls. This is fantastic, $16. Let's see if it's actually big enough. Yeah, I feel like that's big enough for a side dish. Not only that, but you get four of them. It's also fantastic for like nuts or something or literally anything. That's actually a really nice size bowl and $16 is a great deal for four of them. This is a 12 piece set. It's on sale, $10. It's a little out there though. <laughs> it's for a special kind of buyer. This I feel like is more neutral. It has like that rustic look. It's $40 for a 16 piece dinnerware set. They have like the blue tones and then more gray. Here's an example of the gray. Ooh, this might be new. No, it's not. Maybe I just missed it at this Costco, $50 and it's a holding set of dishware. And then they have this set, very neutral, $100 for a 40 pieces. 
I love the prints of these reusable food storage bags. They still have them, 14 bags in here for $13. Screaming deal. I love reusable bags like this. Uh, this I actually have some this brand and they are fantastic quality. Okay, this is really nice. A knife set for $100. You get an eight piece knife set, which I feel like is really good. Not sure about this brand of knives, but that's a great deal for really nice quality knives. You can get a 10 piece over here for $55. Or if you're on a budget, here's $20 for five pieces. I had a set like this for a while. I actually still have the bread knife, I think, to it. Maybe some paring knives. But they lasted a really long time. Not, not as sharp, obviously, because you pay for what you get. This is $18 for a set of five. And not only are they fun because they're colored, they're actually great. This is a new to me item, a 24 piece set. It's called Camp Kitchen Kit. That's pretty funny. Oh, is this for camping? That's cool, it wraps up and stuff. So everything you see here, oh, it even comes with a like a zester or cheese grater, whatever the heck. That's fantastic, 30 bucks. These bowls I feel like have always been so great. I haven't bought them, but I've always wanted to. It's always been on my mind. Um, the It's $15 for four bowls and the lids. I'm looking at these sets of silverware and Alex has been talking about getting new silverware. I don't know what happens to our spoons and our forks, but the little ones, that those are the ones we always use, but I don't know what happens. We lose them over the years. Last time we bought a new set, it's literally been like 12 years. My mom got us one set and then we just have always had hodgepodge silverware. Anyway, this is $25 for, a, oh, 20 pieces. So you get four of each, four, eight, 12, 16. Yeah, four of each. I just want to set with like the little guys, the little spoons, the little forks. I've been looking at thrift stores and I just haven't been able to find anything I love. I don't know. This set is $65 and I'm like, mm. I've seen people talk about this. Oh my gosh, a two pack. Okay, screaming deal. If you are a bento box kind of mom, this is a screaming deal for you. Wait, this is a different kind of bento box than what I'm used to seeing, but you get two of them. It's a two pack bundle. It is the bento brand right here at Costco. So you get two packs in there. Oh, it does come with an extra divider if you wanna put it in there, so that's great. Microwave, food trays, leak proof design, ideal for all ages. I just don't love it because of the size. I wish it was slightly bigger, but honestly it would be great for my pre-K three-year because she eats like a bird. But all my other kids, uh, they eat like they've never eaten a day in their lives. Okay, Fresh Produce Keeper, have those. Great, $30 for the set. Fantastic screaming deal. This is a thermal tumbler. You get a two pack of them, different colors for 20 bucks. Over here, let's look at the cups for a second. Nothing new, nothing new. I'm kind of sad that I'm seeing these at Costco right now because I just bought a new bath mat for Wentworth's bathroom. This bath mat collection comes in a 24 inch by 36 inch, which is a pretty nice size and it's $14. It seems really nice and it comes in a couple of different colors here. And then this is a two pack for $16. What they're reversible. What the heck is happening over here? Um, one is clearly a little smaller than the other one. I'll give you a little sneak peek on the size, but I'm loving the prints. They've got blue, gray, beige, green ish aqua color. Really nice. It's the first time I've seen this. A food disposal, a dispo, what are these called? Disposal machine? My disposal, I guess it's just called a disposal. How do I not know? Anyway, that's the first time I've seen it here. It's $100 if you need one. This is the first time I've seen these. Brooklyn Loom three piece coverlet set. I took a feel ski on it and it feels luxurious, buttery. It comes with the blanket and then also two pillow shams. Queen size is $20 on sale right now, normally 30. King size is 30, normally 40. Even at 40, that's a screaming deal. So it comes in four different color options and they're gorgeous. I'm sorry, <laughs> I'm about to keel over. Is this cr a Christmas item? Is this a Christmas item? I'm not ready. You guys, I'm barely ready for Halloween, stop it. Costco, what in the heck? I ran into a column. What in the heck are you doing? Please contain yourselves. But like, that's real cute, 50 bucks. <laughs> we have Halloween, Costco literally has no idea what's happening. We have Halloween happening over here, Halloween costumes. We have summer bathing suits and then Christmas. Just stop. Well, I guess it's been confirmed. Costco no longer sells 
like pencils and stuff anymore. I don't know. I can't find them anywhere. Ticonderoga, RIP. Look at this sweet summer dress though. That's really nice. Oh, I was just going to say, I wish I had sleeves on it. And this one does have sleeves. Not that it matters. M Meredith wears nothing that I pick out for her. She's so strong-willed. It's kind of ridiculous. Um, okay, so we have, oh, a lot more costume options than last time. I see Anna. I see a fake Elsa, an ice princess, actually. How much is this? Looks like they're $30 for a brand new costume. Costume? And I think I could actually cry because our Once Upon a Child local to us put out their costumes on Friday and I even made a reminder on my phone, but things just got too busy. Look, they do have Elsa. Oh, beautiful. These are $30, so amazing. Oh, Tangled too. Anyway, I've been meaning to go there and get some princess dresses for Meredith and then Wentworth has been asking for something like a Spider-Man costume too. So I'm gonna check them out and see what they have before I spend $30. Even though $30, it's a good deal, but if I can get it for like five at Once Upon a Child, that's obviously a much better deal. Oh, look, a Transformer. All right, what's this blue guy? Oh my gosh, Sonic. Wentworth has a Sonic costume. He would cry if he saw that. $30, I feel like I may have spent, I may have spent more than that. There's also Poka, Poka Chew or something like that. And then up here, I feel like we saw some of these costumes last time, but they didn't have all of these out. There's a dinosaur, there's a pilot, yes. There is a ninja, also a Star Wars guy. We have Spider-Man over here. Okay, Spider-Man for 30. I wonder if I do find this at Once Upon a Child. Stay tuned. We have a pirate. Yes, I should just get this for Gasparilla fire department. Ooh, and then an astronaut over here. Do you guys even know what you're doing for Halloween yet? I can't function. I can't think that far ahead right now. And then we have a soldier. I'll tell you something about Halloween. Um, I'm still wrapping my head around the fact that Wolfgang is going to be one. <laughs> so let me deal with that first. Okay. They have this Sherpa fleece throw. How big is this? It's 40 inches by 50 inches and it's $10. Scream and deal, $10. A blanket for the bedroom kids are excited about it. They have this Pokemon 2 pack. Oh, a pencil case bundle. Collector's chest and pencil case, whatever is happening in there. Trading card game, whatever, $27. And then these are marketed to have for like Halloween or trick and trade. There's a booster bundle. I literally almost fell over. Am I hungry? What's happening? Trading card bundles. How many? There's 120 mini packs in here. And I'm going to tell you something. I've been using them as reading incentives for Wentworth and they are working out fantastic fantastically okay and they also have some lego sets over here for forty dollars and then the friends lego sets i've always been more into these but except for the price okay the horse and stable is 45 and then the dreams tree house or city submarine is 90 so if you can see any of that okay. oh oh here's the dreams tree house Looks wild and crazy to me. Oh my gosh, they even have a deep sea explorer. Ocean explorers. They have Marvel, Star Wars, $80. Actually, I don't know what's what. They're both $80 though. And then they have assorted puzzles. I love that they have the Costco puzzle. It makes me laugh. All Hallows Eve puzzle. Here's the Costco puzzle. Must have been when lockdown happened because look how dang busy it is. They even have Atlanta, <gasps> Pigeon Forge. Hold on, dog walkers, historic. Why did I just think that this is just Costco all the time? Here's an Amish quilt, up, up and away. Christmas morning, oh, I love these. Oh, Sunrise Ranch, I wonder if they have Tampa. I'm sure they do. These are $9. I got a Golden Girls puzzle, I think for my birthday or Mother's Day, and I can't wait to throw that thing together. This is a Zuru X shot. This is $30, it's a two pack. That smells like a Christmas gift to me, okay? Grab them while they're hot. There's also these squish collections. Okay, hold on. Something is $10, but I don't think it's this. This is 28 and it has all of this stuff included. And that's what it looks like on the front side of it. These are great birthday gifts. This is a super set jewelry design for $30. And then some cars for 17. Is it at least like a controllable car? I don't know, don't ask me die cast oh my goodness i could cry okay 17 dollars for these i don't remember how much these go for and tell me if i'm wrong 
did the Disney store close? Do the, like all the locations around me close? And I live in Florida, which is kind of ridiculous. So how much do these go for in a normal store? I don't know, but they have Elsa, they have Rapunzel, they have Moana, they have Belle and Maribel. So dang adorable, $17 for these. And it comes with like their little counterparts too. Oh my gosh, Meredith would cry. Does it sing? Like, does she sing? I don't know, it doesn't say. But hey, since we're talking about Christmas, here are all of the ribbons. You know, those crafters, they need to craft early. And those are $8. Here are, I don't know if all the ribbon prints were up there, but I'll give you a glimpse on the rest of them. And then these six pack of glow wick candles for $25. And you can color them any way you want. So that's pretty cool. This is $50. Was there one like for show before and now it's gone? I don't know what the heck happened to it. So I guess it's just a Disney holiday lantern snow globe maybe for 50 bucks. I'm sorry, why? I actually walked past a bunch of sweaters and stuff for Florida Gators and I think they had some USF stuff too. <gasps> Florida Gator in the camo print. Okay, these are cool. Those are the colleges local to me. Sometimes they have FSU stuff here too, but obviously not here. <gasps> oh, look how cute. That's so cool, but for 45 bucks, I well, I guess you get a two pack. Hashtag worth it, although I would never buy it. Okay, <gasps> a plush blanket. This is a great like gift, holiday gift. If you're doing white elephant or something, these are fantastic quality. Uh, and $23 is a screaming deal because at home goods, even during the holidays, they're like 30. Okay, and then they have these chairs, $40 a piece, but they are like the official like college chairs. And then they have the Buccaneer chair over here. Oh boy, that's pretty sweet. I had a really good time last time going through the books. So I'm gonna look again. I'm sure there are things that I missed or maybe you didn't see it. Sweet Valley, <gasps> Sweet Valley High, a graphic novel teacher's pet. Oh, I wonder if Meredith, Eleanor, oh no, that's like a graphic novel. Avelina used to be really, really into the graphic novels. Not so much anymore, she grew out of it. Van Gogh, I was trying to think of his name the other day. I couldn't think of it. I just kept thinking of Da Vinci. All right, such fun. So they have some chapter books out here. Nicholas Sparks, okay, what's his new one? What is it? Dreamland. Look out for the movie coming soon, right? <laughs> One True Loves. What do we got over here? The 620 Man? What do we got? Need Me? What do we got? Get a life. All right, that's enough of that. Chase Me? Oh my gosh. A, a Pick Me Girl? Okay. Make Me? Chase Me? Make Me? A Broken Beautiful Novel. Guys, I don't read, so I just can't get into that. Are you more of a fiction or non-fiction kind of gal? I'm actually more into Fancy Nancy because she is amazing. I never heard of the Cupcake Diaries. The first eight Cupcake Diaries. Oh, maybe that's too old for Meredith at her current moment in time because she currently cannot read on her own, <laughs> but I can read for her. The Never Girls. The Never Girls? Oh, like the, the Neverland Boys, Narnia up in here. Okay, they have a lot of box sets. Ooh, the shoes. Okay, we'll explore that in a second. They have some fun sticker pad activities for $15. And then ready to read sets. They've got Cat in the Hat. Ooh, Blippi has book sets. Oh, he's a billionaire. Is that right? Uh, we have Five Minute Animal. Five Minute Animal? What is this? Five Minute Princess Stories. That's actually a good one. We've got Dinosaurs, PJ Mask, Princesses, Six Early Readers. This is $8.79, so that's pretty cool. Last time I came, I got the set of fancy nancy books and meredith has been enjoying those so much so worth it they also have tummy time books a bunch of board books over here first words scrabble i need some scrabble ideas when i play i need some word ideas Ooh, that's pretty cool okay shoes they have these men's light racer and these are 35 bucks have you ever bought shoes brand new we went to the Nike outlet the other day and oh my gosh, was it a zoo. We have Skechers for $29. Okay, nice, nice, nice. We've got Pumas over here for $25. Nice, nice, nice. We have some unisex cushion slides. Oh, nice, 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 nice. They also come in a different color. We've got these pink and black. And these are all the rage, very trendy, 10 bucks. Obviously there must be like a different brand that is worth more. I don't know, that's, you know what? 
it's like croc 2.0 and i've just never been able to get into that i'm not a croc lady i'm a lily pulitzer lady <laughs> i doubt don't even own lily pulitzer shoes and i could never afford them but that's okay maybe i'll find some on thread up they have these floyos the sandals for 15 bucks comes in a couple different colors and then some cozy faux fur insole shoes. Ooh, yes, a J Sport. That's the kind of gal I am. $25, I've actually seen that like ugly shoes are back in style. I mean, I guess if you saw the, the cloud shoes or whatever the heck those are, those are pretty ugly. But what I'm talking about is like a strappy, ugly shoe, like a hiking shoe, if you will. Those are in $29 for these Skechers, $29 for these Pumas. Oh my heck, I'm crying. A, ba a Disney Baby two-pack blanket sleeper. Look, it's, um, oh my gosh, Marie. I was not expecting that. I just saw the 101 Dalmatians. Okay, now I'm crying. Three months. Uh, Wolfgang literally sleeps sleeps well he doesn't do that but he does sweat in his sleep when he does sleep and so i don't think i would ever put something like this on him obviously it's going to get cold soon so anyway this barbie we saw this last time but honestly if they had it in my size i'm pretty sure i would buy it this is just so dang cute i love the jacket it doesn't have a price for this i think this is the smallest size that i can find anyway it's a 4t Oh my gosh, I would cry. They also have it in Minnie Mouse and then the DC. I feel like I showed this last time. Maybe I didn't show the Spider-Man. So let's just do that real quick. Everyone loves Spidey. Okay, they have a ladies scoop neck in a few different colors. Nice. Oh, these are nice. A pull on. I like how the waistband is elastic and they are a little cropped. I enjoy that. Although um, these are a little more tapered than I like when I have a cropped pant on, but they do come in a few different colors and they're 12 bucks. And then a two-piece lounge set, oh my heavens, a two-piece lounger, and it feels very luxurious, very soft. It is $16, normally 20, and it comes in a few different prints. We've got stars, we've got polka dots, and we have stripes. Back to the kids section over here, these Eddie Bauer three-in-one jacket, these windbreakers. Oh, come on, for 20 bucks, it's such great quality. And then they have a two-piece set with a sweater and then some pants, so adorable for 20 bucks. Even more over here, they have a ladies flutter sleeve. Actually, that's so cute for $17. I really like the silhouette of that. This one ha looks like it has a little cinch happening. Oh, maybe that's the sleeve. Yeah, it is on the sleeve. Okay, so same thing, but a different print. And then they have some skorts. Oh, this actually is a dress. Where did this come from? Maybe someone made a choice. It is really cute and lightweight. And then this came out of nowhere too. Ooh, someone made a little outfit. These were the sweaters and shirts that I was telling you about. They're the Florida Gators. Normally Costco, wherever you live closest to, normally has like whatever NFL or college team around you. Ooh, two pack of everyday shorts for $15, normally 20. These could be something. Okay, I like them. They're cotton material, if you're wondering. And then the men's flannel shirts over here. I have seen the shackets, flackets. I don't know what they're called. I saw those. This comes in a few different colors for $17. They have a few joggers over here too. I really love this purple color, but it also comes in black and they're $10 right now, normally 13. And then, ooh, I might like this even more. This is, looks like high rise, a printed pant, 14 bucks for these. I'm loving that. Digging the colors for these too. This is $10 for a twill pant, whatever that is, I don't know will i like it i can't even think about wearing a sweater right now or dressing my kids in one but they do have these carters four piece sets for 18 dollars. carters is awesome oh my gosh little pjs on the back oh are they all pjs okay i can dig it and then a swimsuits of course costco doesn't know what the heck they also have some pj sets for the girls and some of these jersey lined jackets for 15 dollars. the brand is Gary, Jerry, interesting. <laughs> I found the shackets. People love them. Look, she's trying to run on right now. It's fantastic. 
if you ask me, it's way too hot. I'm wearing something that's literally like so light and I'm still sweating. I don't know how she's walking around in a jacket, but they do come in really cute colors and prints. 15 bucks, screaming deal. If you wanna sweat, these are pajama sets, a pack of four for the boys. They got dump trucks and stuff. And then they have some sweatshirts and shorts for eight bucks. Ooh, found a sample. It's a salad with some avocado lime. Are you feeling saucy? I am, I'm hungry. This is the first sample. I've never had a salad. Thank you for lunch, Costco. Finally, we made it to the food section. They have old fashioned lemon bars. I don't know if I'll be able to contain myself. These are $8.79. Oh, I'm crying. I want those real bad. Banana walnut mini loaves. It's a mini loaf. You just eat one at a time and then you, you know, grab another one, $9.69 for that. Well, people in the food section are acting a fool. We have Raisin the Roof over here, the Dave's Killer Bread. I can smell it wafting, it smells so great. They have the white bread here too, which I was surprised, haven't seen it at this location before. And I'm looking for the gluten-free bread, hmm, to no avail. I love how they cater this to like back to school stuff. <laughs> a Hostess Baby Bunt variety, you get 82 of them, 82, I'm not dyslexic, you get 28 for $10. Honestly, lemon drizzle and strawberry cheesecake, sign me up. Normally I see beets in the refrigerated section, but I see them like shelf stable, whole, peeled and cooked. $8 and it's a pretty hefty box. It says you get a pack of three, like that's a huge pack of three. If you haven't tried these yet, I would really encourage you to do that. It's $12 for a two pack, so you get eight of them. And this is the almond filled Danish. Oh my gosh, it's so good. Hard to not eat all four in one sitting. And then this, ooh, green chili cornbread. Are we having chili one day? Tomorrow's football, so I might grab this and let you know how it is. Green chili cornbread, I mean, say no more. That looks really delicious. And then is this the first time we've seen these mini lemon cakes with buttercream icing? Sign me up, $9, one, two, three, six, nine. Nine, I gotta go. <laughs> okay, they have cheesecake, who the heck cares? This is the main attraction over here. You can tell it is a crowd pleaser because there are literally two left. Peanut butter chocolate cream pie, $20. I got this thing, I think Christmas or Thanksgiving last year, maybe Easter, maybe Easter. It was a crowd pleaser, you guys. The people are still talking about it. The highlight of Easter is sitting right in front of me. <laughs> I'm eating some cinnamon bread. It's not great, I'm not gonna lie. It's not the Frank's killer selection. But they do have a killer selection on these wild cooked dungy crabs. Oh, dungeon? Dungeness. Hooked on phonics, you guys. The glare in here, I don't know, whatever. These look cool. This might be the worst sample I've ever had in my entire life. Not that you could tell what it is. It's, kind, it's a spicy goat cheese. I don't know what kind it is, but it's a no for me. This is one of the best cheeses we've had in a while. And uh, it's, a, it's a yes. Okay, mango habanera. Is this, oh, here it is. There it is, that's the cheese that they wanted to sample. She's really hyping it up, but don't don't believe a word she says. <laughs> I'm looking for some aged cheddar. Some aged cheddar that I can put in the kids' lunch boxes. Okay, is this like a yellow cheddar or white cheddar? I have got questions. I haven't tried these egg bites, but because I always have the Starbucks ones, this is a good deal, $12 for two, four, six, eight of them. Spinach and bell pepper included. These are fantastic. I'm gonna snack some of these for dinner, these chicken crumbles. Uh, it's on sale for $10, which makes it even better a deal. Love this. I've never seen these before either. A two pack of salads, like on the go, spinach bacon crunch. And it comes with, I don't know, some almonds, some bacon and some crunch. $6.79 for two, I feel like is a great deal. Normally at my Publix, they try to sell one for like six bucks. This is new to me too. These uh, same brand, chicken meatballs with basil and Parmesan. I feel like this would be great. In, oh, they're chicken meatballs, by the way. This would be great in like a red sauce or I don't know, they have a lot of different flavors. I haven't tried this one yet, but it seems like it would be, you know what, should I try them? Okay, let's do that. I like basil and I like Parmesan. They have these mango jalapeno sausages, the little ones, those are cool. And then the chicken apple, still no bacon pineapple again. Oh, these beets, these are the refrigerated cooked beets. 
It's $9.59 for four individual packs. So you can kind of see in there. I haven't seen this Kevin's. We love the Kevin's brand. Wish the portions were bigger. Pork belly stir fry with citrus teriyaki style sauce. It's $13. Not that huge, but I'm sure it tastes great. If you're looking for a quick lunch or a, a quick, easy dinner, I mean this with a bagged salad and you're good to go. Oh, beef and short rib? Holy cow, what the heck is happening? Beef and short rib is on. Okay, well, I haven't had this one before, but I've had the normal one. This is on sale normally $16. It's on sale for 11. That's a great discount. 20 grams of protein per serving, fantastic. And then these are on sale too, the chicken and pepper jack burritos. I feel like at one point I bought these. Did I buy them? I can't remember. Maybe Alex ate them. $9 normally 12. I'm gonna pass. If I don't remember, it couldn't have been that good. I had to come back here for some lettuce and I noticed they have their apple pie out for fall. Apple pie, yeah, in the sky, yeah, yeah. It's 13 bucks? No, I don't know how much that is. How much? Okay, yeah, $13. And then, then they have the ooey gooey cinnamon rolls. These are $13 too. Honestly, I'd go with the apple pie. If you are into fish spread, you are in luck because Costco has this honey smoked salmon spread and dip. I just, not for me. <laughs> $9.79 though, that's a screaming deal for anything salmon. I'm gonna grab my new favorite salsa. Looks like that lid maybe is a little open. This is my new favorite. This is my old favorite. Still really good. I should do a taste off, but then I'll have so much dang salsa. Um, I had this once when I was pregnant and I just haven't had it since. Honestly, everything I ate when I was pregnant was horrible, so I should really give it another chance, but here we are. Finally, I found them the peeled garlic cloves. I'll use that, it's like a week supply. I just snagged some of this. It's at like a sample spot, but like how can you actually sample that? Um, fantastic price here. Hopefully I find it on the floor somewhere so I can actually tell you the price. It's on sale right now. This Windex, if you're into that, ooh, it's a heavy bottle, $13.29 for that. It is 32 ounces. No, 32 ounces plus 169 ounce refill. I was like, I can pick up 32 ounces. Okay, anyway, I know I haven't worked out in a while, but my muscles are still a little bit there. This is a multi-surface variety. It's Mrs. Myers. You get three 24 ounce packs and it's $16. So that's a screaming deal and they're huge bottles. So fantastic. I guess I'll mention these because they're here and they are on sale for $14, normally $17.69. You get 36 refills in here. I do think it works. I think it's a fantastic product. I just don't like the amount of waste that it has. Do you know what I mean? But if you're into it, they have them here on sale. All right, here's the laundry sanitizer. It's normally $17, but it's on sale for $13.49. Uh, crisp linen scent. You get 150 ounces in here, liters? Ounces. And it's a screaming deal compared to the price of like Target. It's a huge bottle and I love this stuff. I use it in every load. So I bought this poppy stuff last time because it's like a prebiotic so soda. I should have known for your gut health, you guys. I just thought it was like a seltzer water. No, it does have caffeine in it. Uh, low sugar, five grams of sugar. It's got prebiotics for your gut health and immunity kickback. I don't know, it's $20.99 for 15. Not buying it again, but if you like it, it's here at Costco. It's the first time I've seen these Chobani drinkable yogurts. I normally get these from Publix. They often have a buy one, get one free. I don't love that it has the plastic cap, but I do love it that it has the plastic cap for schools because kind of spill proof. Okay, 12 bottles for 15 bucks. Another sample, they have a Lunchable, yum. Well, these are selling like hotcakes. Normally $15, they're on sale for $7.50 and they are the gluten-free, lightly breaded chicken strips. I'm wondering if I should get two of these and that's exactly what I'm gonna do. Oh look, and they have it as a sample, so I'll get to try it out. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, where are the Lunchables? <laughs> okay. Smoked ham and Swiss cheese pockets. What the heck? $13.69, how many do we get? Eight individually wrapped pockets, $13.69. That could be really great. Couple new products, I see these Eglin's Best Omelets, three cheese omelet for $13 and you get eight of them. And then this Mason Dixie Cheddar Biscuit Sandwiches with sausage and egg, 15 grams of protein, cage-free eggs are $15 and you get eight. The cheddar biscuit, mm, it's really getting me going. So 
so much happening in this little corner. They have the Eggo waffles, scream and deal, twelve dollars. Then they have the pancakes on sale for ten fifty, and I have never seen these before. The farm rich cinnamon French toast sticks, nine dollars and fifty nine cents. These are my kryptonite. I could literally probably eat this whole box because it's like just eating air. They're so good. I probably shouldn't buy them, but here I go. My pie's about to fall. Okay, and then this brand, Made With Veggies, they have the blueberry oat muffins and Meredith, whatever her name is, Eleanor, <laughs> loves the chocolate muffins. We haven't had chocolate raspberry, but they're gluten-free. They are one gram of sugar made with some veggies. So I'm gonna try these out. Football season's among us and they have 18 bacon wrapped stuffed jalapenos for $16. We've had those before, so good. These are the gluten-free pizza bites. They're the bacon, or sorry, uncured pepperoni. Listen, had them for, the first time I had them, I was like, Ugh. but the second time I had them, they were pretty good. Uh, you know, sometimes your taste buds change. And also I think it depended on the way I cooked them. I also see this Motor City Pizza five cheese bread, five cheeses? I don't even know five cheeses. $10 and uh, you get a whole deep dish thing. Oh, my mom used to love these growing up, these French bread pepperoni pizzas. And I don't think I've had them since I was a child. Can you even see or there is the reflection so crazy? $12.50. They must have known I was coming for these Lunchables, I tell you. Someone changed their mind. These cauliflower pizzas, they made a good choice because they are fantastic. They're gluten-free cauliflower crust. The veggies on top, perfect amount. It's really good. And you get two pizzas for $11.79. Burt's Bees for Dogs Oatmeal Shampoo. This is incredible. I love Burt's Bees brand so much, $15.39. Okay, deviating from my plan. I see these out of the corner of my eye. What the heck is this? A pepperoni pizza crisp. Hold the heck on, 13 grams of protein. I think I'm gonna pick these up, $10. They do contain milk, but seem to be gluten-free. I'm excited about that. Screaming deal alert. I've never seen this at Costco. A two pack for $9. We're about to have our no summer nacho bar. Even though summer's over, uh, I still promised them a nacho bar. So here it comes. I think this is the first time I've seen this. Maybe not. The Kinder's barbecue sauce. This is the Honey Hot. I don't know how I feel about the Honey Hot, but it's $7. I feel like I should try it, but then if I don't like it, I have this honking container of Honey Hot. This buffalo season is among us chicken buffalo what is it called buffalo chicken cheese buffalo dish chicken chicken and cheese buffalo what the heck is it called chicken buffalo dip i feel like that's it it's got to be it right 9.69 for a two pack of the frank's red i should get some i don't okay well i usually wait for a sale but i don't have any not even a drip drop I am kind of sad that I see these and not the sweet potato crackers. I've seen other people have the sweet potato crackers. I, those are my absolute favorite. We might, I might run into them later. I don't see any, I'm looking around, sad. The lines are ridiculous. Literally, I'm in like halfway down the store and there's a huge line waiting. Go, go squeeze for the big kids. Never had this 33% bigger pouches, big raspberry and big cinnamon. And I think I'm gonna give these a go. They are $12.50, but then they also have the apple pouches and then the fruit and veggie pouches. And because Wolfgang is just a big, big boy these days and he needs a big, big pouch. Chia squeeze. I have saw these last time, 10.59. They won't be around much longer. I thought this was interesting. They changed their container. It used to be this big honkin' plastic container. And now this is maybe less waste. It's the peanut butter powder. Uh, $13.99 for a pretty hefty portion of that. Hey oh, I haven't seen these before. They are Savor by Susie Grain Free Pretzels Sea Salt. $6.99. Interesting, they're gluten free. I'm gonna try them out, but you know what they do have? Cheetos, the crunchy Cheetos, and then they also have sun chips. Oh my gosh, someone stop it. <gasps> Spicy deal and pinkle. $3.97. How can I not buy like more than one bag of this? My thighs, that's just what I have to remember. My thighs, $3.97, what a scream and deal. They also had, oh, I'm salivating, uh, Doritos and another chip too for like six bucks. Oh, the hippies up here. I love to get the hippies here. They have the packs that you can like, they're individually portioned and they have the white vegan cheddar and the nacho cheese. My kids love them both, but I'm gonna grab the big bag for munching. Also, what the heck is happening? Brownie brittle for $2.97? What is no one buying this crap? 
they're out of their minds. I actually don't like it, but <laughs> my family loves it. Looks like lots of chips happening up here. We've made it across to the other side. Someone made some choices here, but this looks like it's going out $13 for 20 bars. Maybe it's because of the price. I will say these are fantastic, superior to the Kirkland brand. They're more satiating. Uh, I really enjoy them. Can't say enough good things about these. Still have yet to try these though, I'll tell you. They're ex they look so cute and I love them. They were on sale one time, but I didn't buy them. And uh, I packed them in my nurse gifts. No one got back to me on if they liked them or not. <laughs> I didn't give any of them my phone number. Not that they would have gotten back. Not that I was like, hey, let me know how you feel. $16 for a 20 pack of these. These are on sale normally, 20 bucks. This is crispy protein treats, salted caramel, and vanilla dreams. Okay, so these are Simply Fuel Protein Made Easy. These are gluten-free chocolate coconut peanut butter. They're like energy balls, my energy balls. They're $12 for probably one batch of energy balls <laughs> that you can make, but if you are in a pinch, you don't have time to make them, you don't have all the ingredients to make them, this is a fantastic, convenient option. It's a zoo in here. Okay, this is what I was talking about. 24 bags, you get the white cheddar and the nacho vibes. It's $11 for all of that, if that's your vibe. I think Eleanor really likes packing them at her lunch. I think she loves them more than everyone else. Meredith loves them too. Should I grab them? I don't know. Uh, cream filled wafers up in here. I haven't seen those before. Oh, and then Oreos. Oh gosh, this is the good aisle. <laughs> Wait, what? I've never seen this before. Hold on, someone's behind me. I gotta turn around. Okay, what the heck is happening here? First time I've ever seen this. Obviously Pringles. Holy crap, $24? Oh, there's 36 of them in there. Okay, this is $20 and you get 26 packs. You get 13 of each, 13 uh, nachos, the circular, what are those called? Tortillas, chips, they're chips. And then you get nacho cheese dip. This is so cool, I've never seen that before. Fantastic. I mean, I'm not buying it, but like I would want it <laughs> in my lunch. And then they have a variety pack of these really great grain-free tortilla chips. You get 14 bags. Oh, they're on sale right now for $11.79. Normally $14.79. So scream and deal. I might pick these up. They have nacho, lime, and sea salt. They're grain-free, which is always a plus. My kids love these strawberry probiotic yogurt bites, and they're on sale right now. $9.89. Normally $12.89. So I'm going to snag these up. I've wanted these for a while, still not on sale. Skinny dipped cups. I actually don't know how much they are. There's no price tag. Uh, so they might be on sale. Dark chocolate peanut butter cups, mm, two grams of sugar. And then they have these orange dream almonds. You guys, the coconut ones are my ultimate fave. Haven't had these before, but I'm not a huge fan of the orange. $16 if you are. Oran roasted almonds covered in orange cream. Good for you. And then the Fannie Mae, what the heck is happening? They're getting ready for fall and Christmas, I tell you, because these are going out. $4.97. I should grab two of these. They are not the best. I've made a more healthier version of this. That is absolutely fantastic. But I bought these last time and the kids obviously loved them because it's some more, it's like sugar on top of sugar on top of sugar. I haven't seen these before either. The made granola minis, I guess they're on sale. You guys, the line is so long. I can't even like really shop around here. This is real fruit whips, 180 feet of fruit fun, it's 10 bucks. Oh, look, they do have the chocolate covered almonds, coconut. Look, here it is. Oh my gosh, and they're on sale. Somebody stop me. 10 bucks, normally 15. I'm not going to get them, but I want them. Yeah, the sugar free one just had it. Fantastic. Wish they had it in strawberry. They might. I don't know though. Just ordered my contacts, so that's good to go. This is the largest bottle of micellar water I think I've ever seen in my life, and it is on sale for $13, normally 17 I didn't go up and down these aisles. Mostly because my cart is just so stinking massive. Okay, so they have the Olay. This is on sale for 13, normally 17. Just kidding, this is $16 for three. I didn't really see anything else. They have gum picks, placards that I haven't seen before. This pop floss. Oh, I thought that said bleach. I was like, uh, I think we need to rethink that. Um, I don't really see anything else worthy of mentioning. Uh, conditioner, that's, oh, eight, eight seventy four. That's a screaming deal. Shampoo and conditioner, Pantene. I always like to stock up on that. The hand soap collection, that's always great. Makes the line a little easier to bear. They actually have these as a sample. It's my lucky day. These are the Kilimanjaro nuts. This is sample two. I hope no one is waiting for my spot because I need to run back in the store for diapers and a case of water 
hurricane season is among us and I need to unload all of this stuff. Oh my gosh, I'm already out of breath just by pushing the dang cart. By the way, there are no more carts left. That's how busy it is. Lord help us all. Crumbs everywhere. Going in for round two. <laughs> oh, wow, wow, wow. Uh, yeah, do you see that? Unreal, unreal, okay. Thank you guys so much for watching, hanging out with me. I'm surprised that they didn't have more Halloween stuff, like Halloween candy at least. I don't know, I feel like the other store definitely had more Halloween. They had that huge, gigantic skeleton that you saw in my last shop with me. And if you didn't, I'll try to link it below. I'm not good about that, just search it. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, hanging out with me, shopping with me. If you want to subscribe, put a little happy in your day and I'll see you next time, bye.